to say is If I was your girl, all the things I'd do to you I'd make you call up my name, I'd ask who it belongs to you If I was your woman, the things I'd do to you But I'm not, so I can't and I won't But if I was your girl It's your girl Gladys, aka Is That Your Hair, and welcome back to my channel. Now I know it looks really white right now. There's a lot of sun coming into this room, and I have my ring light on, so I almost look like I'm blending it, like my clothes are blending in with the background. It's kind of cool. <sighs> We're just gonna work with it. All right, so today I have a brand new unit that just came out like two weeks ago by Sensational. <laughs> And I have this wig in the style Boss Lady. Is it sensational? Oh my god. Outre. No. Outre. Let's jump right in. Boss Lady comes with your standard cap construction. She does have the two combs in the front, comb in the back with adjustable straps. Let me give you a quick 360 of the wig. All right, Boss Lady. Boss Lady originally came on the scene in the half wig version. There was Boss Lady and Rainmaker, its longer big sister. So I didn't purchase the half wigs. But when the lace front wig came out, I was like, you know what, let me hop on this bandwagon real quick. And I got Boss Lady because I felt like I would like Boss Lady better due to the length. Rainmaker seems like it's a lot of hair, so I'm still not sure if I want to purchase that yet but based on what i'm seeing right now I, I like boss lady she's really cute let's jump into the pros first pro of boss lady would definitely have to be this beautiful natural hair texture i really really love it when i first started wearing synthetic wigs back in 2015 there are very few natural hair wigs that i felt like looked natural i used to wear the vanessa lej wig a lot and as that wig got older it looks so realistic. I love it. I still love it to this day. But there are very few wigs that had this type of texture, this blown out yakky texture. There was another wig called Outre Test, which I thought was cute. There was another one called the Annie wig. I can't remember if that was by Outre, another company. But they had a few that were this blown out yakky texture. But that was back then. And the lace parting back then wasn't that great. But now you have Boss Lady where it comes with a part that honestly doesn't really need to be plucked. And it has this really nice yakky texture. It's getting two thumbs up from me for that alone. Another pro to this wig would definitely be the cap construction. To me, it's very big head friendly. I know I do have a medium sized head, but as I was moving the cap, it seemed very stretchy and accommodating for larger heads. Another pro to this wig is the style. I think this style is so cute. Literally, this looks like my natural hair when I blow it out and put maybe some steamrollers in it or you know some perm rods this looks really really natural I, I think they did a good job with mimicking natural african-american black person's hair look at this let me get a little closer do you see this texture oh my god boss lady you are so cute yeah you guys I don't have too much else to say about this wig. I think the style is cute. I like the cap construction. The only con I would say is, you know, when it comes to this texture, I don't know. It doesn't have a lot of movement. Like I was trying to shake it like this and it just felt a little stiff. And I don't know, maybe there are some filler hairs. I, I don't know if that's puffiness from the texture or do, if I feel filler hairs back here. I would have to examine it a little bit more. So overall, I would say there is a lack of movement. But that's the only con, really. I think this is definitely a cute unit to pick up. My girl Hearts and Cake 90 reviewed this unit. And I definitely agree with her when she said that this unit, how good it looks, Kind of depends on what you wear, which is why I paired it with this off the shoulder top. And I chose white just because I felt, I don't know, it felt like a little angelic when I wore this hair. <laughs> and I found my white choker. And I think this style combined with this outfit right here, 
I think it looks really good. Also, I did clip Boss Baby a little bit. I know y'all probably like, bitch, you are always trying to cut some hair. Like, just leave the hair alone. I can't. I just can't. But no, I clipped just a little bit of the sides just because I felt like it wasn't framing my face well in the beginning. Oh, I need to clip that back piece right there. But once I did that, I did like her a little bit better. That's how I feel about these wigs. You have to make it your own. If you see something that you don't like, fix it, clip it, chop it, shift it to the side. Oh, maybe we can wear this in the middle. Let's see. So I'm normally a middle part girl. Boss lady in the middle would have to be I would have to play with her some more in my bathroom where I have a mirror because I, I would I would probably cut this, cut this, I would fix my parting underneath, I would flatten this out with my with my um curling wand. And honestly, I don't have time to do it right now. But I'm just telling you, this is what I would do in order to make boss lady work from the middle. But we just gonna shift it back to the side, okay? Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. How are you feeling about Boss Lady? Do you want to get Boss Lady? Also, do you think I should try Rainmaker and Lace Front version? Let me know. Would you watch that video? If you comment down below that you want to see it, I'll do it. I'll probably do Rainmaker in a different color though because after Hearts and Cake 90 reviewed it in the, um, I think it was a 30 color, I was like, ooh, I might have to get that. Shout outs to Britt. Yeah, let me know how you feel. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Check me out on Instagram because I'm on there a lot. You know, right now I'm shadow banned and it sucks, but that's another story. Check me out on Instagram, follow me on my stories. I am traveling soon. By the time this comes out, I might be in my new destination. So if you want to keep up with me, Instagram. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.